Ah, mpenda mtazamaji na kusalimu kwa jina la Yesu Jambo. Unajua kwamba uko mzima na Mwenyezi Mungu ameweza kukulinda tangu tulipoachana wiki iliyopita na Mwenyezi Mungu ametufanikisha kufika uh, siku ya leo. Niko kwa Mama Josephine ambaye last time niliweza kuweka clip chake hapa na nashukuru kwamba mumeweza kutusaidia kule ambako mlikuwa mnaweza. Kwa leo ni kwa ndaka ni watarifu vile ambavyo tuli Uweza kufanya shughuli kwa sababu niliwaambia kwamba tunaenda hospitali. Uh, kuna wengi ambao wamekuwa kiuliza maswali kwamba kuliendaje? Hawajapata picha, hawajapata clip, hawajapata any conversation uh, kuhusu mama na leo tumekuja kwa ili tupate kupata moja kwa moja. Tuko na Edina hapa na rafiki mwenzake, watoto wako hapa, kijana yake yuko hapa ambaye yako last time. Lakini nataka kabla tuanze, kabla tuanze, tutaka tumshukuru Mwenyezi Mungu kwanza ili tupate kuendelea na conversation kwa maana tunajua kwamba Mungu ndiye ambaye ametusaidia hata kula ambako tumefika kwa siku ya leo imekuwa kwa neema yake Edina just pray for us Tanda. Mungu na baba wetu ni asante kwa mchana wa leo ni asante kwa kuwa umekuwa nasi umetulinda tangia wiki iliyopita mpaka wiki ambayo tumeanza leo Mungu wetu sisi ni wenye dhambi ambao tustahili machoni pako tunaomba utusamehe na utusafi Mungu wetu asante kwa ndugu Dennis naona yenye anaendelea kufanya kwa ajili ya huyu mama aweze kupata hela ya kumrudisha hospitali tena. Mungu wetu asante. Huu moyo wacha endelee nao. Ni wengi Mungu wetu wanaumia kama dada Josephine. Lakini naamini Mungu wetu kinyesha mkono wako na ukiwakuza na kaa lako la moto. Mungu wetu watapona na watashukuru jina lako. Nyumba hii Mungu wetu. Tuna siti kushukuru kila wakati. Tunapoingia tunapotoka. Mungu wetu ipitenda yaliyo mapensi yako kinapoanza saa hii kipindi hiki mpaka tutakapomaliza Mungu wetu ili uweze kutawala. Saidi Mungu utukufu wako uweze kuonekana kati yetu. Takapopenda kutenda haya yote Mungu wetu uweze kupewa sifa na utukufu. Asante Mungu wetu kwa kuwa utatenda yaliyo mapensi yako. Tumeomba tukiamini katika jina la Yesu ili Mungu wetu. Amen. Amen. Basi mpenzi mtazamaji Uh, nataka ni kutaarifu kidogo uh, jinsi ambavyo hali ya mama ipo na kwanza kabisa ningependa kushukuru wale ambao mliweza kuingiza mfuko mkono kwa mfuko mkaweza kutusaidia mama Josephine akaweza kwenda hospitali kuangaliwa najua kwamba wengi walikuwa natarajia kwamba uh, akue hospitali hadi siku ya leo na jinsi ambavyo Edina alisema kwamba anaenda kumwacha hospitali hata mimi nilijua kwamba ataenda kwa hospitali hizo siku zote atipiwe hadi ya kuwe sawa lakini ikawa kwamba wamerudi naye baada ya siku kama mbili tatu najua kwa wengi mmekuwa mkiuliza maswali kuliendaje mama yuko hali yake ikoje nimekuja leo ili tupate kuongea moja kwa moja na Edina pia mama yuko hapa ili tupate kuelewa kwamba kuliendaje na kweli chiza ambavyo tuliimba kwamba tutawataka msaada pesa ilipatikana Edina nianze Tuliweza kusafiri salama kufika Eldoret ilikuwa siku ya Jumatatu. Okay. Na kwa sababu alikuwa na maumivu. Mhm. Mm Tukaenda hospitalini. Mhm. Mm Akaweza kupewa injections. Okay. Tukarudi, tukatafuta uh -huh. mahali tukalala. Yes. The following day tukaenda the clinic, the normal clinic in Mandanga. Yeah. Tukafika the process uh -huh. um, sio kitu rahisi. Okay. It needs someone who can confirm that. Okay. Lakini uzuri tulikuwa tumeenda watu wawili. Mhm. Mm Mmoja akiwa kwa line hii, mwingine akokuwa line nyingine. Okay. Sasa ilifika wakati tukaenda kwa daktari. Mhm. Mm daktari mwenye alikuwa na mhudumia. Aliweza kuita the consultant, the oncologist. Mhm. Mm Vile aliangalia dada Josephine, she si recommended mm -hmm. she needs to start chemo immediately. Okay. Of which kama tulikuwa tunategemea kadi ya NHIF, uh -huh. you have to wait for 48 hours. Okay. Na ukilipa cash, uh -huh. you you get the services immediately. Okay. For which tulifanya hivyo. Yeah. Na akaisa kufanyiwa kemo. Uh -huh. Na mungu wetu ni wajabu. Okay. Maombi yenu, yeah. mungu waliesa kuyajibu. Niliona mkono wa mungu. Amen. Kwa sababu, tuliambiwe kifika wan, hata pata kemo. Mutangocha uh -huh. until the following day. Uh -huh. Lakini mungu wetu ni wajabu. Uh -huh. Hiyo one around saa sita na nusu okay. machibu ya lab mm -hmm. before ikatoka. ikatoka. Yeah. Ya kuonyesha vigo zake siko sawa. Okay. Damu yake iko sawa. Aha. Uh -huh. Akaenda akaanza kemo. Okay. So haiko ime spread vile tupata hata ndio 
kwa menda sana eh uh-huh. lakini ilikuwa inaanza kuja the the, oh, right the other side. side okay so daktari kasema uh-huh. we need to start it immediately yeah. so that is spread to the right okay so that came mo kuna vile nasaidia eh yeah. you know, i don't understand about it uh ukisema mbona kemo samina na shinda kemo sasa huyu ni daktari oh she can explain to us okay. because mimi ni mwalimu yeah. she can tell us about kemo how it works sasa kabla tuende mbali kidogo tu tuelewe hii kemo ni nini hata mimi nijue kemo ni uh-huh. dawa tu okay. inaweka kwa maji uh-huh. kama drip sasa kama na mwasaline ama kitu yote tu inateremsha inateremka uh-huh. na hiyo dawa inasaidia uh-huh na hii ni mas mas unajua inaendelea kugiro yeah. sasa so, ukiwekea kemo hizo uh-huh. cells zina uh-huh. badala za kugiro zinapungua okay zina okay so zina reverse back zinarudi yeah, back yeah, to normal yeah. Yeah. okay then na zingine cells zingine zinaweza kufa uh-huh. zingine zinaweza oh yeah mm-hmm. okay so daktari akasema hiyo uh-huh. it will squeeze out hiyo maji hiyo hiyo yeah. matiti uh-huh. with time uh-huh ukirudi itakuwa inaendelea ku reduce the size okay. and that one reduces the pain also the pain okay so na inaenda for 3 hours aha uh-huh. so for na na rara vizuri ana maumivu vile kama mwanzo ana maumivu kama ile ya siku ile sio okay. sana okay okay lakini kwa matiti iko mm-hmm. okay na uvimbe bado upo upo lakini unaendelea ku reduce ku reduce mm. so um are you going back again ama hiyo chemo vile mlifanywa uh, kwa hiyo mara ya kwanza kwa walimaliza kila kitu. Haiwe mbaya. Okay. Tunarudi huko tena mwezi wa 5. Mwezi wa 5. Eh, uh-huh. suppose kwenda 6 sessions. Mhm. Uh-huh. Ndio waone bila na respond. Okay. So tukirudi uh-huh. wata review kuone ana kahaje. Mhm. Okay, uh-huh. okay ana respond well. Yeah. They continue with it for Okay. 6 six, six okay. uh, sessions. Okay. And then kuna majibu tuliendaye kuchukua. Yeah. Haikuwa ready uh-huh. so daktari requested uh-huh. has to be given to let the aga can okay of which uh-huh. atunge be on that day on tuesday okay he repeats his to us kulala uh-huh. so to lala elder again uh-huh. do to kape we machibu the following day that's on wednesday uh-huh. and then uh, it is a process it's a process yeah okay daktari ana sign huyu mwenye ana recommend mpewe mhm uh-huh. uh-huh and then the see the see you uh-huh are a proof that you pay we okay final god uh-huh. is wonderful yeah yes to pay yeah direct a hug can so we are waiting for two weeks uh-huh. to pata majibu yeah. as we go back to eldoret uh-huh. kwa na hiyo majibu tupeleke daktari okay but for now uh-huh mimi nikiangalia dada josephine uh-huh. mungu wetu ni mwanajabu amempigania ana seed okay na yeye mhm uh-huh kuna matumaini yeah. atapona uh-huh. na sisi tuko na matumaini yeah. huyu mama uh-huh. atafanya nini atapona, atapona. ile tulikuwa tunaenda nyinyi mlikuwa mmeshaenda uh-huh. watoto walitusindikiza mpaka hapo okay hao watoto walikuwa mess yani you know the way uh-huh. wakati mama ametoka the way you feel yeah ili niguza okay okay uh, but wakati tulirudi uh-huh. the children were happy okay hata bila waliona mama yao the mm-hmm. state yenye alikuwa nayo yeah walifurahia mama yao amefanya nini amerudi amerudi kasi yenye watu wamefanya mm-hmm. na washukuru okay tukiwa na moyo kama huu wacha yeah. tutendee wenzetu cool. not just for alone no. there are so many people when you are going at the bona itaji usaidizi na itaji usaidizi mm wacha tuwashughulikie pia yes and i think watu wapende ku i don't know what i can say mm. about kwa kila manyumba so uh-huh. we are going to count 10 uh-huh. we need to have a, a case study in uh-huh. every community uh-huh. ndasapata kuna watu wenye wako na upungufu kama yako kweli mapungufu na na sisi hatujui kweli i think that is something uh-huh. we need to do as a community i think sasa hiyo ni kitokana na mambo ya wale ambao ni hapa uh, tureti and those are the one i think they are supposed to do that yeah ndio wajio kwamba wala watu ambao in every 10 houses watu wako safe ama wakoje yes yeah. it is very important mm-hmm. because niliona i got so many challenges mhm niliona katoto ka 3 years kanafanywa kemo mhm ikachiuliza na wewe mtoto ametenda nini you know there are so many things you can ask as yes. a human being yes but uh-huh. god has a reason why yeah really 
niliona wa mama wazi watoto wadogo utakupigia please ngocha kidogo eh kutoka kwetu hapa niliona watu wengi okay ukiwa peke yake and i think the challenge our sister Josephine had alikuwa peke yake anachukulikia okay ukiwa peke yako you mm-hmm. can finish a whole week the whole week eh na utapata the right thing you are supposed to pick yeah. because last ma utoke uende yeah. kwa lab okay last ma utoke uende kwa ct scan uh-huh. last ma utoke uende histology okay histology ni kwenda ikuchukua hiyo majibu yako okay. na urudise mm-hmm. kwa daktari wako mm-hmm. sio daktari mwingine wako yule kama huyo alikuwa mm-hmm. na daktari wake okay. so daktari wake anaita mm-hmm. another doctor, doctor to review okay angalie mm-hmm. the recommendations okay akimwambia fanya hivi anafanya of which niliona daktari wakifanya yeah hakuna kuruka mtu raini okay. inendorate okay. okay. uh-huh. because the same patient uh-huh. has the same uh-huh. problems uh-huh. aise akaona na mtu mwingine uh-huh. anaona na yule specific uh-huh. doctor mwenye anafanya nini anamhudumia okay our people are sick yeah wacha tuombe okay 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 thank you for that uh, for, thank you for that information i think uh, for those ones ambao mtutazama mshaelewa kwamba hali ya Joseph ni jinsi ambavyo ilivyo sasa Edina my question is that uh, we've been looking for money uh, quite a number of uh, uh, kitita cha pesa kizuri eh? ambacho kitaweza kumsukuma Joseph ni kimsaidie na pia na watoto wadogo hata kama si magonjwa yale pia watoto pia wanahitaji usaidizi because they don't have their father na wanahitaji kusoma nzuri kwamba ni watoto ambao ni waelefu sana the way nili was study last time mami unaendelea kopoa na wewe nzuri sasa hii mko na furaha mama anaendelea kupata uponyaji mm. ya okay now mm. last time you were crying sasa mko sawa kijana mm. nianze last time uko hapa ulienda kutembea hapana eh nilikuwa nimeenda kufungua oh yeah. okay uh, nani was very much sasa i think they know uh-huh. Kwa nini yeah, I don't request swali langu kwamba uh, tulijua kwamba alikuwa supposed to be admitted ya hospitali kwa sababu tunajua kwanza si kitu cha nayo si malaria. So I knew kwamba vile ameenda hospitali atashughulikiwa hadi apone. Sisi kazi yetu ilikuwa kwamba ni kutafuta pesa. Okay. Hmm. The reason why he mm-hmm. was not admitted. Okay. Sio yeye peke yake. Aha. Uh-huh. Those are clinic that is a clinic center uh-huh. watu wanaenda wanaangaliwa okay wana wakiona ya ya huyo mtu iko more serious uh-huh. wana mtena uh-huh. so wakati walisema wacha wafanye kemo uh-huh. so tulibauliza maswali uh-huh. kwa nini am admit okay. akasema we can't admit chosen yeah akishafanywa kemo uh-huh. she has to go back okay. home uh-huh to wait for another 3 weeks. Okay. Reason being I uh-huh. think wanaangalia uh, mfuko nayo. Yeah. Kwa sababu daktari aliongea. Uh-huh. Kwa nini unaweka mtu kwa ward? Uh-huh. Because yakisha fanywa kemo yeah. anapewa some drugs. Okay. So drugs sikiisha uh-huh. you are supposed to go and buy uh-huh. and buy yeah. if you are able. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Au unaenda in a public ward hospital uh-huh. unapewa. Uh-huh. Na hiyo dawa uti, utapewa bure mm-hmm. you have to udasimu utafanya nini utagaramia okay. wakasema just mm-hmm. atakuwa anaendanga huko mm-hmm. for chemo yeah and other review okay yeah okay it's okay uh, unajua tu, tunafuata mashadi ya matakitari yeah. ni sababu ukisema kwamba kae kule hospitali ni sawa ukisema aenda nyumbani ndo wakuje kumwasess baadaye waangalie pia inakuwa sawa kwa sababu tunategemea kile ambacho wanatuambia swali langu tulikuwa tutafuta pesa ndio maana tukachukua kilimo na tukaweza ku share tu our friends ndo tusaidie. Ha, kufikia sasa I know kila ambacho tumepata si pesa mingi sana na ni kipato kipi ama how much do we need now because she supposed to go back uh, in six times yeah? yeah. Okay. Kiwango cha pesa kila ambacho kinatekana sasa ni kipi ama imetosha? Eh no. Kemo peke yake is 25,000. 25,000 ujanunua dawa uh-huh. atafanya procedures uh-huh. because nikipiga mpaka hesabu ile yenye tulifanya uh-huh. it is around 40000 40000 40, eh okay. atweka transport uh-huh. atweka food uh-huh. uh, at, accommodation at, accommodation atweka okay. okay we need a lot of a lot money, money. 
for cancer patients ni uh-huh. sisi nikasema ni pesa kidogo uh-huh. maybe mtu atasafikiria tume we have raised 200000 yeah. that is nothing okay. because sasa hivi rako hivi kuna chakula sasa hivi atakana kunywa sukari atakana sukari kabisa kabisa completely uh-huh. na atakana kule ndizi uh-huh. kule miwa uh-huh. kule mapera yeah akunye juice uh-huh. there are so many things kuna specific food anataikana kufanya nini akule akule uh-huh. of which uh-huh. we have to chip in through this hiyo pesa ni watu wamefanya nini wametoa wametoa okay also akona watoto yeah hii ni nyumba ya kula kweli. Mm. Hii ni nyumba ya kurentisha. Yeah. So um, she needs a lot in the shop. Eh uh, slit sini salot. Aha. Uh-huh. Kwenda peke yake uh-huh. if it was a public means angekuwa amepata mtu mwenye ni mbaya uh-huh. angetumia pesa mingi. Okay. Eh. Uh-huh. Kwenda tu peke yake. Kwenda Eldoret na Kurud. But hari yake uh-huh. haingekubali aende na public. Okay. Because she was in too much pain. Pain. So, so ili bidi mtafute private eh ili tu ili tu bidi tutafute mm-hmm. gari yenye atakuwa comfortable yeah. kama hiyo siku nyenye tulifika mm-hmm. tulimalizia kutoka saa mbili usiku saa mbili okay Uta, utatoka kwenda wapi you can't can't yeah. na, na kuna car hiyo pia na kutoka MTRH kuja town uh-huh. is far okay. is from hapa mpaka Kisi town okay okay utatembea usiku na mgoni <laughs> na nyumba yenye mnaenda kulala you mm-hmm. can't sleep with her in the same okay. bed okay okay Yeah I know. Lasma akarara uh-huh. kitanda yake. Peke yake. Eh? So in short in short the dinner tuseme kwamba whatever you receive last time mm-hmm. um exhaust um exhaust everything. Ziko zenye uh-huh. tuna lakini kidogo ya kum ya maintenance. Ya kumua, madao uh-huh. kama saa hii uh-huh. she needs to be dressed. Okay. Eh, oh, every day. Every day. Mm-hmm. Every day. Uh-huh. Last my end hospital. Okay. Ah uh, we have to call someone here. Uh-huh. Last ma tutanunua hizo vitu. Okay. Mm-hmm. So every day you are spending money. Money a lot of money a lot of money okay so mtu asiseme eti tumetoa 10000 yeah kuna wale ambao wametoa baadhi ya wale ambao wanasema kwamba ah kesi hiyo tumemaliza tulituma pesa akatibiwa na mambo yote yakaisha kutibiwa si once eh yeah. huyu ni daktari she can tell you okay sasa unaona kama hii hicho kidonda kilikuwa na kilikuwa previous hii kilikuwa kinanuka lakini yeah. leo mkisikia yeah, hakuna kweli kweli harufu tu anadresswa kila siku every day na hizo ni pesa lakini hata daktari it's more expensive okay kimpeleka hospitali pia yeah. ni pesa. Okay. Yeah. So toka sasa baka tusema amepona kabisa aweze kurudia ile kazi yake ya kawaida ya kutunza watoto basi itakuwa imemgarimu sana. Pesa mingi. Mm. Because kama jana kuna mm-hmm. dawa tulinua Eldoret mm-hmm. nilienda hapa kwa pharmacy. Yes. Tablet moja uh-huh. 70 bucks. 70 shillings. Sasa uh-huh. na hizo anatakana kunywa for 3 weeks. 3 weeks. Hiyo ni pesa ngapi? Wow, that's a lot of money. Na hiyo ni dawa mm-hmm. just one. one. Kuna nyingine yenye atukupata. Okay. Na wao wakaniambia mm-hmm. moja ni 50 bob. Aha. Na hiyo for three weeks. Okay. Eh? Jua hiyo ni pesa ngapi? It's a lot of money. Mm-hmm. Basi um, penzi wetu mtazamaji uh, nimekuja kujua jinsi ambavyo ni pesa kiwango kipi ambacho tunahitaji kuwa nacho ili tupate kumsaidia dada Josephine ambaye hali yake ya kanza uh, inamu, imemulemea kwa sasa. So maana ya kuja pia tuhitaji bado msaada maana kuna wale labda mko pata kilipu cha kwanza ambacho tuliweza kuchukua na tumekuja mara ya pili tupate kuchukua hiji clip ili tupate kumsaidia Dr. Josephine ambaye akona ugonjwa wa kanza. Watoto wake ni wadogo hapa na wote wanahitaji usaidizi anzia chakula wanahitaji wasome na pia jinsi ambavyo tulio taarifu mwanzo ni kama kwamba baba mzazi hayupo Josephine unasikiaje sasa Nasikia ni kona nafu kona fu eh aha Haki nashukuru sana yes. kwa kazi ambayo mnaendelea kuihudumia Thank you Acha Mungu aendelee kuwabariki Yeah asante Eh yote ambayo yamehusika kwa juu yangu mm-hmm. Mungu amubariki yeah. na azidi kuwabariki Amen Na yote mwenye hajanifikia mtaweza kunifikia kwa wakati wa sasa Okay eh. Kuna wale ambao wamekuwa ki piga labda wakituma pesa na wanasema kwamba hawajapata majibu kama pesa ilifika au ikufika. Kwanza wengine wanakutafuta WhatsApp au wakupati. WhatsApp mimi simu yangu siko. Unakale kamili kamwizi. Eh. Okay. <laughs> eh wengi wamekomplaini mpaka kuna mwingine alinituma kaniambia nenda kuhakikisha kwamba ujue kwamba pesa ilifika au ikufika kwa sababu hakupata response. Wengi wakituma eh. wanahitaji response kwamba pesa imefika na shukuru. Lakini ikifika ikifika kwa hiyo namba mm-hmm. lazima inaingia lazima ikufikie eh, okay eh. sasa vipi uh, mara kwanza tulipotoka hapa na ukaenda hospitali ukarudi vipi kuna mabadiliko kuna mabadiliko 
Okay. 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 Na we really appreciate whatever you sent us. Tunajua kwamba kuna mambo ambayo yanawasunguka kama corona. Wengi wako quarantine. Wengina waende kazi. Nimepata zimu nyingi wengi wakisama kwamba kweli atu, atu, atuko kazi. Kama yukua kwamba ni wale wakati ambao wakikua kazi. Ili tatizo wangelishugulikia. Lakini tunakubali. Lakini tena toomba kwamba ikiwa unachechota ambacho waweza kutuma. Ili kumsaidia dada Josephine. Basi mekalipisho. Kuna ile namba mbao tulikuwa tunatumia last time. Naomba kwamba tupate kupeana hiyo namba. Kwa sababu nana mda wetu kama umeisha. Tupate kupate hiyo namba pia na account. That whoever wants to send money. Anaeza katuma. Nataka ni shukuru kuna chile kikundi. Mbacho ni cha whatsapp. Wanaendelea kukusanya kile kidogo mbacho wanapata. Na tunatumia ni kwamba hii wiki. Matokeo atakuwa mazuri. Na watakuwa umeleta kile kidogo mbacho. Wamekusanya. May God press you guys. Uh, kwa kile kitu mbacho munaendelea kufanya kujali masrahi yake mama. Ebu tupate hiyo namba ya simu na account namba. Kwa leo sitaonyesha picha. Okay. Yeah, kwa leo sitaonyesha picha uh, watazamaji. Kuna wale ambao nauliza, mbona tuoni picha yake jinsi ambavyo <laughs> ni mgonjwa? Naomba nitakuchezea zile picha za mwanzo zile ambazo tuweza kuchukua kwa sababu pia hata last time haikuwa vema tupate kupost picha yake jinsi ambavyo ni mgonjwa lakini kwa sababu ilibidi na si wote ambao wanaamini tuseme tu ni mgonjwa na pasi na kuona ndio maana tukaiweka nitakuweka picha ila ambayo tuliweza kunaza last time na uone jinsi ya jinsi alivyo sio kwamba kwa sasa amepona lakini nile kwamba makali yale ya uchungu yamepungua kidogo kulingana na ile ambayo mliita aje chemotherapy ambayo aliweza kufanyiwa so i'm requesting that we need your help Bado kama unachuchuta ambacho unaweza kutuma, bado tunaitaji usaidizi. Uh, tupe namba ya simu na ili account number. Baby. Aha. 80. Baby ni 80. 13. 13. 55. 55. 9. Namba ya simu. Nambari ya simu. 0721. 0721. 27. 27. 75. 75. 86. 86. Majina. Majina. Josephine Gankyo. Josephine Gankyo Sarara. Sarara. Okay. Watazamaji, hiyo ndio Josephine Gankyo Sarara. Ukituma pesa inafika kwake. Na simu ambayo ni ya WhatsApp hana. Na labda ukituma pesa na uona hayo majina yamekuja kujua kwamba ni yeye. Uh, tunaomba msamaha kwa wale ambao labda mnatuma maswali me. kuuliza can, kama pesa imefika. They, they can, can call you. They can call me. Okay. Through this number. Okay. 0721. So 721. Iyo ni Aidina. Yeah, six, if you want to confirm. Mm, 694. So 7? 21. 21. 694. 694. 699. 699. To confirm. Uh-huh. Kama pesa imefika. Kama pesa imefika. Okay. Kuna moja hapa tuta confirm. Mm -hmm. Kuna mwingine hapa niambia kwa mbati tuma kama uh, 10,000. Lakini jina yake. Okay. Kulizia. Achapata majibu sasi kama pesa kilifika ama ikofika. Anda uh, kuna pesa ambayo uh, pia ikuwe metuma. Ile pesa ambayo ya kwanza, I think ni tutumu ulipata. Ya 45. Ya 45,000. And yeah. these those guys ambao walisema kwamba wana kusanya pesa watume mm. kwa, kwa si account. Siya ni update. Yeah. Mm. Thank you. Uh, kuna wala ambao ni tumi ya hapa, half 12,000. Na hiyo inatakikana ni tume tu saai saai. Mm hmm. Yeah. Mm. Nipatia, nipatia your number. Zero seven two one. So seven two one. Twenty seven. Twenty seven. Seventy five. Seventy five. Eight six. Seventy five. Eighty six. Eighty six. Yeah. Two one two seven. Seventy five. Eighty six. Eighty six. Yeah. Okay. Twelve thousand five hundred. So I think yapo ndo to make kamisho. Tumati. Na ikiwa kwamba kuna yara ambayo ina maswali wataka kuuliza, muulize Edna. Edna kwa hapa ili apate kukupa jibu la 
kitu ambacho wataka kuulizia. Acha tukuage na tukwambie kwamba miko oppressive za zingine unaweza kushangaa kwamba mbona audio official inapenda ku post tu watu wako na mashida, watu wako na wanahitaji msaada, it's a core. Na kuna kitu ambacho una, unasikia kwamba kama hujafanya moyo wako utulii. So this is uh, what we do na tunasikia kwamba sisi tuko sawa. Sio kwamba kuna vipindi vingine vya ku, vya kuweka. Lakini tushughulikie au wenzetu ambao wako na matatizo. Kila mtu akiwa sawa hata tukiweka a uh, lot of programs za kucheka za ku dance tunajua kwamba tunacheza watu wetu wakiwa wako sawa lakini sio kwamba tunacheza hapa tunafanya hiki na kile na watu wetu huko nyumbani wanatezeka may god bless you tuonane wakati mwingine nitakapokuletea uh, update nyingine kijana na wewe kendo kwani unaelewa kikisi ndio mwanikaza mwano wewe sasa tulikuja pa last time huko kapata kuweka clip kidogo ili watu wapate ku, kumsaidia mama. Ni nini ambacho tunaambia watu wana ambao wanatutazama? Wale ambao mlitusaidia kwa mchango wenu. Aha. Nasema asante sana. Okay. Na Mungu awabariki. Okay. Mama Sai anaendelea na hali yake kiasi tu kidogo hivi. Okay. Hali yake iko sawa kiasi. Okay, okay. Unasoma? Ndio. Daraza? Ni form 2. Ko form 2. Nyamu Kenya School. Okay. Supporting school. Day and boarding. Day and boarding. Na jizi ambafe mama mekua ni mgonjo, mekua jiu kipata uh, school fees yako mekua kipata aje? Anakua kifanya kazi, uh-huh. kinilipia school fees. Ok. Iyo kazi ya mchengo inatosha. Wakiti mungu na kuanga shule ama unafukuzo fukuzo? Kuna wakati nikuwa nafukuzo, uh-huh. wakati mgeni nikushule. Ok. Ndiyo. Ha, bado na mwe wakusoma? Ndiyo. Mm, we hawa, hawa walisema, mmoja walisema nataka kwe daktari, mgini hakasema nataka kwe mwalimu. Na wala wakua nini? Mimi nataka kuwa engineer. Engineer. Ndio. Okay. Wakutengeneza nini? Kutengeneza ndege. Ndege. Ndio. Oh, ulitengeneza helicopter? Iko wapi? Kuna vitu na ungano za hapa. Oh, ah singekuwa na moja hapa tuangalie chanzo unatengeneza helicopter. Okay, si una unaenda kanisani? Ndio. Na unaamini kwamba utatengeneza kwa helicopter siku moja? Ndio. Okay. Acha Mungu asikie maombi yako. Basi mpenzi mtazamaji, acha tukuage. Ya tukuage hadi wakati mwingine tukabakuletea tena another program usijoke nasi kwa sababu i know there is kuna vile Mungu ametuunganisha pamoja na wewe ukiyapata haya mambo you not getting is in a, an accident way unayapata kwa sababu kuna vile Mungu ametuunganisha na tupate kusaidiana hizi si kuchacha ambazo tunaweza hizi uh, si kuchacha ambazo tumeishi dunia daktari una kitu cha kumalizia mimi ningependa kushukuru shukuru nyinyi wote kwa vile mmetusaidia sana ili jambo litutuguza tukiwa na idina wa mwoso mimi sana wakati nilikuwa naona huyu mtoto akitembeza kitapu kwa kijiji huyu oh, ndiye alikuwa anakuta huyu eh Aha. kitapu exercise book hivi anatembeza kwa kijiji aha hiyo dina kaniuliza tutafanya aje aha. tusaidie huyu mama aha na kaniuliza tukiweka facebook aha. watu watasema aje yes. nikamwambia ni tasa huda idea aha wacha tuweke tu tuone yeah. tusaidie huyu mama. Yes. Huyu mama sana sana kama mimi amewahi nyosha nguo. Okay. Ni mama anaosha nguo uh-huh. na anafanya kazi ya mjengo. Tulijua uh-huh. tu ana mtu wa kusaidia. Yeah, yeah, na yeah. nikiangalia kuna time niangalie hicho kitabu. Uh-huh. 20 pop, uh-huh. 10 pop. Yeah. Sasa ukipiga hesabu hii ni pesa ya kukula uh-huh. ama ni ya kupeleka mama hospitali. Siku ya kwanza niona mama uh-huh. si kujua kama ni yeye but siku yenye nilimuona juu namjua vizuri sana miaka mingi uh-huh. it is now nine years okay. nimemjua uh-huh. nilishangaa chumama alikuwa na uchungu angeweza hata kukaa na shindwa kukaa na shindwa kuinama uh-huh. so it was painful okay. but nashukuru sana kwa yote yenye uh-huh. mmetutendea uh-huh. si eti ni Joseph ni peke yake mmetendea okay. ni sisi wote juu na we can sleep yeah. naomba muendelee kutusaidia uh-huh. msimuache huyu mama mpaka uh-huh. time yenye atakuwa tu na nguvu yeye endelee kufanya kazi yake yeah. asaidie watoto wake okay thank you thank you jospin neno la mwisho tumalizie nasikia tumalize tusimalize lakini sasa wewe ndio unaongea neno la mwisho ndo tufunge kipindi tutoke hapo hakisi na nakosea umekosa maneno nashukuru sana okay kwa upendo wenu kwa mmoja wenu yeah Saidi ya yote uh-huh. Mungu ajazie. Yeah. Awake awape hekima. Okay. Na marifa uh-huh. ya kuendelea na hiki kikundi. Yeah. Mbarikiwa sana. Yes. Akitanisaidia na kubarikiwa sana. Sina mengi sababu ya maumivu makali. 
sina mimi sina umma sana hebu nifanyie hata fadhali kwa hiari yenu na watu watapotoa kwa ndani nitabarikiwa sana namba yako ya simu utatuonyesha barua na barua yako hapa yenye niende nikasimu ya ndionyesha grade tu hai ini ya siti scan ya kifua ili kifua ya kifua sasa mabarua mengine yalibaki huko ndio nitaenda kuchukua next week ya kufanyia ni matibabu sasa naomba tu kwa hiari yangu munisaidie mimi naishi kisini daraja mbili lakini kazi tutaweza nipata nambari yangu ya simu ni 0721 27 75 86 0721 na mtabarikiwa sana Mazikini ni mbaya wapendwa Umazikini ni mbaya wapendwa Umazikini inaweza kufanya ujue jambasi Hata kama hujawa